Hello friends, this is Angel Soriano, and in today's segment of Daily Dog Man, I want to discuss storm anxiety in dogs. It's real, friends. Thank you for tuning in to this segment today, and remember to subscribe to this channel by hitting the little bell button to receive notifications when we have new releases, right? So please give us a thumbs up as well and add a comment if you like what you're seeing. We love getting your feedback, by the way. So I am reminded about storm anxiety in dogs today since it's our start of the storm season here in the Midwest. This means that we will see severe rain, we will see severe storm, obviously, tornadoes, our share of tornado, tornadoes as well. So yes, we get those in the Midwest and they're sort of dangerous, right? So storm anxiety is real for some dogs and I would imagine other animals in the, in the kingdom as well. Some humans have storm anxiety as well and I've seen it firsthand. So understand that it is natural for people to have the storm anxiety simply because we have the ability to reason and then understand the consequences of a storm, right? So the question is, why would a dog have storm anxiety if they truly do not have this deep level of comprehension? Good question. So this might be where you come into the equation. So here are a few of my ideas. One, some dogs are nervy or skittish and the pure sound and activity is enough to scare the daylights out of them. These dogs are typically also afraid or anxious of something dropping on the floor that makes a loud noise. Two. Some dogs are conditioned to not like storms and react negatively by their very owners, meaning some people have these anxieties themselves. And the dog picks up on the human's discomfort, their concerns, their actions, even panic sometimes. So let's face it, if mom and dad are worried about something, there's something to be worried about. Three, if your dog has displayed other anxieties in the past, such as separation anxiety, it is very likely that they will also demonstrate storm anxieties when they are present. It is a normal reaction for them to act that out as they, it, it's something that's worked for them in the past, right? So they'll repeat it. By the way, dogs typically train themselves to understand that the storm is coming due to the barometric pressure changes that take place right before a storm. These usually take place hours in advance, so the dog has an opportunity to work themselves up into a frenzy by the time the storm really hits. So uh, be aware of this. So what do you do, right? That's a real question. What do you do? Before I start with the behavioral tips, I would recommend that you talk to a veterinarian and ask them to prescribe an anti-anxiety medicine. It's always a good idea to have something like that on hand in your cabinet, just in case the condition is really bad or the storm is horrible, etc. It's just a good thing to have. By the way, the best you can expect from these type of meds during a storm will be to tone down the anxiety. It will not cure it, it will not eliminate it. It'll tone it down, right? Which is really your way of helping out your little buddy so they don't feel as bad during the storm. So now that I got that out of the way that is out of my league in, in many ways, medicine that is, I wanna get into the behavioral aspect of the question. So again, one, do not coddle or excessively love your dog when they start acting out their storm anxiety. They respond by giving you more of it, okay? It's hard, I know, but stop it, don't do it. This action alone will get you so far in their recovery. Let's move on to number two, entertain them. This is gonna be fun for both of you. So entertain them during the storm, play with them, get silly, get on the ground, throw a ball, throw the toys, play with them. Okay, if your dog sees that you have no issues with the storm, they too will start to learn that this is really no big deal. Stop making a big deal of storms and they will soon follow. Number three, play some soft music, right? Play soft music in the house while you're doing this playing that I just mentioned or this goofing around. You'll both be relaxed and you'll both do better through it. So these are... Just a few tips alone that'll get you through the hate it storm season this year. Trust me, it works. Just practice it, you'll notice it, okay? Give us a comment back when you do. On a passing note, just call us if you struggle with this training or any other training, severe behaviors, etc. This is what we do, and we'll be happy to help you out. That's it for now. This is Angel Soriano, barking back at you on Daily Dog Man. If you like this video, please help us out by subscribing to our YouTube channel. We also appreciate your comments if you have them. Remember, there are three ways of keeping in touch with us. One, you can email us at dogman at mykaninu.com. 
Two, you can sign up to our email list at mykaninu.com forward slash Ask the Dog Man. And three, you can subscribe to this channel by hitting the subscribe button. You can find all of this information in the comments section below. Thank you.